Hey everyone, in today's video, we're gonna be testing out an app on the Apple Vision Pro called Spatial Media Toolkit. It allows you to take your 2D videos and convert them into 3D stereoscopic videos. I'm gonna take some of my old videos that were captured in 2D and convert them to 3D, and let's see how good they look. All right, so first let's go ahead and open up Spatial Media Toolkit. By the way, this is my new persona in Vision OS 26. What do you think? Hey Suri, open Spatial Media Toolkit. Let's start with this video, which is one that features my dad on his 60th birthday. We got all of the family together. We're talking all of my six siblings, as well as all of our kids. So it was a pretty packed house. But you can see that I captured this back in 2019. I got it in normal 2D. And we're now going to convert this into Apple Spatial. So let's go ahead and click Convert Video. And you can see it converting the video down here at the bottom. You can see that it's spatializing this video frame by frame. And I know you're watching this in 2D, so this probably looks like it's 2 dimensional but for me, I could already see the depth in the video as it's converting here. Okay, so the conversion process just got done. I've got to say before I hit play, for everyone watching this on a 2D screen, it's going to look like it's in 2D, but just know for me, I can already see the depth as I go like this. Let's go ahead and hit play. That's so cool. The depth on this is a really cool touch. Let's go ahead and close this one down. And now we can save it to photos on our Vision Pro. You can see that it now shows up on spatial here in the ornament. So let's go ahead and click on that. Once your spatial video is in photos, you could actually go up here and click on this. And now it's like I'm in this moment again. I'm getting a little emotional just watching this video. All of my kids and the nieces and nephews have gotten so grown up over the last six years. I absolutely love my parents. And I'm so glad that I was able to capture this moment in time. But it's really cool that now in 2025, we can recreate this spatially. And watching it in this format, it's like I'm back there again. It's so much cooler than you'll ever get on a 2D screen. Wow. That alone was worth checking out this app. All right, so let's go ahead and check out another video. So in this case, let's take this video that I recorded about seven years ago. This was captured on my iPhone back then in 2D, but let's take it from normal 2D to Apple Spatial. This one is 720, so let's go ahead and convert it. As you'll see down here is you have the option to control the depth. So I could actually take this all the way over to a 4.5. Let's leave it at two and let's go ahead and hit convert video. All right, let's go ahead and hit play on that one. <laughs> sometimes on the edges you'll see some artifacts here that maybe weren't done 100 percent correctly but it's pretty darn close you can see that we've got apple spatial we also have side by side stereo i prefer the apple spatial all right and then we'll save that one to our photos album and then before i go and watch that in photos let's go ahead and start another one so let's go ahead and take this video here i captured in 2020 in costa rica from my iphone you can see this one's in 1080. let's go ahead and convert this one and while that's converting let's open up our photos album and let's watch this one now that's in spatial i know you're watching this on a 2d screen but you could just see as i'm moving around here it's kind of like looking into a portal all right, so now this video is converted to Apple Spatial. Let's go ahead and save it to our photos and let's go ahead and play this one. Wow, that one's really good. That's really good. I highly recommend using this 1080 footage if you've got it. Of course, it's so much more crisp, but you can really see the difference in spatial. Let's go ahead and close that down and let's save that to photos. And while that's saving, let's go ahead and convert one more. So let's take this footage of my wife and I back in 2020, again, in Costa Rica. I had the GoPro camera up on my head and we're doing some boogie boarding at Flamingo Beach. All right, so it says that this footage has converted. Let's go ahead and watch this one. I know I keep saying this, it has to look really lame in a 2D screen, but in spatial, it looks so cool. All right, let's save this one to our Photos app. This day is like a core memory for me. My wife and I are just enjoying Costa Rica, and now I can rewatch this spatially, and it feels like I'm back in this moment. Ah. <laughs> it's like how I remember it in my mind, but now I'm watching this.
All right, so what are my honest thoughts about Spatial Media Toolkit on Apple Vision Pro? I'm gonna say that it's not 100% perfect at taking 2D videos and converting them to spatial videos, but it's really good. It's the best I've seen yet. And there's something special about watching a spatial video instead of a 2D video. So I'm now going through the process of finding all of my old favorite videos that I captured in 2D and recreating them into spatial videos. As you can see, it's available on the App Store. It's a free download. It has over 700 reviews. If you love Apple Vision Pro content and you really like today's video, please do me a favor and hit that like button and make sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video and we'll see you on the next one.